VMware vRealize Operations Manager provides a new and greatly simplified approach to cloud operations management, whether managing private, public, or hybrid clouds. A complete architecture overhaul now delivers advanced scalability and resiliency. vRealize Operations Manager can be deployed in a scale-out cluster consisting of virtual machines called nodes. These node appliances can be deployed in a multi-node configuration to significantly increase scalability, flexibility, and ensure high availability. Let's look at the key components of the vRealize Operations Manager architecture. The collector module handles resource data collection initiated by the management pack adapters, then passes the data to the controller module. The controller determines where data will be inserted into the cluster and which nodes own the data when queries are processed. The analytics module handles metric calculations, stat storage and retrieval, threshold processing, and alert generation on any node. The persistence module handles writing the data from memory to disk. A vRealize operations node can assume a variety of roles. The primary roles are master, master replica, data node, and remote collector. The master node manages global data for the cluster and also assumes the role of a data node. The master replica node receives replicated copies of global data from the master node. The replica will also take over the master role in the event of a master node failure. The data node contains the core analytics engine for processing incoming data to determine dynamic thresholds and capacity calculations. The remote collector node allows you to collect data across high latency links and feed it back into the vRealize operations cluster. Remote collector nodes can also run on operating systems that are different than the cluster data nodes. For example, you can deploy Windows-based adapters on a Windows-based remote collector and feed that data to a vRealize operations cluster running on Linux virtual appliances. To interact with the cluster nodes, vRealize operations manager offers two user interfaces, the admin UI and the product UI. The admin UI runs on every node and provides access to administrative functions such as cluster management tasks. The admin UI is primarily used when the product UI is not available. For example, when configuring a new cluster for the first time or when upgrading the vRealize Operations Manager application. The product UI runs on all nodes except remote collectors. It is the primary user interface into vRealize Operations Manager and provides access to all the product content and management tools. With an enhanced architecture and many new features, vRealize Operations Manager gives you improved scalability, flexibility, and redundancy for your most demanding cloud management needs. To learn more about the capabilities of VMware vRealize Operations Manager, visit vmware.com slash go slash vrops.